Speaking of shiny and smooth hair, we thought we would spend some time talking about pomade. Yeah. Pomade is one of those products that, uh, you know, as a black woman, I've always known about. <laughs> but, uh, you know, some women will look at it and they'll think, can I use this for my hair? Yes. So we've got our three lovely models up here, and you're going to show us different pomades for different hair types. It's one of the most misunderstood products out there. Yeah. And there are many types. Uh, the, the original pomade is quite waxy. Yes. And now we make them a little bit stickier and some of them a little bit glossy, depending on what you want to achieve. It's like some shine. Like some, some shine. shine. So we've got Ber Bergy. 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 Bergy has. Bergy's our model. Bergy has a hair that's very uh, not uncommon, and she's got a lot of hair, but it's very fine in texture. Uh -huh. Right? So it's not thin, it's fine. Right. So one type of pomade that we have is one that adds a little bit more texture to okay. hair, right? And a little goes a long way with these products. See that? That's it. Yeah. Right? And that's you, why they come in such small containers. Yes, and you can always add more. To take it away, you've got a shampoo. Could right. you hold that for me, Bergie? Okay. Emulsify in your hands. And I tell people the easiest way is to tip over and, and ruffle your ends because pomades go on the end of your hair, oh. not the roots of your hair. Because that's, is it too heavy it's for It's too roots? heavy, especially on fine hair. What it's going to do is it's going to weigh the roots down. It might make them a little bit greasy. Got it. So, Keep, keep in mind... Don't make fun of her. He's going somewhere with this. Keep in mind... <laughs> I am. <laughs> keep in mind that, that products that go on your roots wet... Yes. This is a good little rule. Products that, that, that go to the roots, they go on wet hair to create volume. Right. Products that create texture go on dry hair and only on the ends. Ooh. Did that make sense? Yes, that did. Okay. That totally did. Yeah. So you see, okay, now all of a sudden nice. we can get some volume, volume some and texture and peasiness. Right? Very nice. Okay, let's okay, move now, over to Deb, all right? Deb. Different kind of hair, different kind of pomade. Right. So this is more of the traditional waxy pomade. Yes. And some of them are a little bit softer, and some of them look like they should have a wick in them. Yes, right? yeah. That's when the you, kind I know. And when you, sorry, what is it ahead. about her hair that would make you pick that? It's thick, and yeah. it's it's a bit stubborn, Okay. and it's got that guts Give to it, that it can take it. If you buy one that's really, really stiff, take your blow dryer and heat it up a little bit first, that's and right. that'll make it easier to come out of the, the little pot. Right. Again, this is going to be hard for you to see, on my finger, but this, can I get you to hold that for me? Mm -hmm. I'll do it on my hand. That is more than enough. That's all you need. Oh, yeah. Just a little smear. A little tiny bit. Again, emulsify it. This is much stiffer. Mm -hmm. And again, on the ends. And this is where you kind of can ruffle the hair mm -hmm. and you get all that pieciness. Oh, my and God, you look so cool right now. <laughs> look at that. Right? That was so easy. And then, if we, and then you just sort of, again, you touch the ends and you can start to define those pieces. Yes. Right? So it doesn't look so much like a little bit of a dandelion gone to seed. Right? <laughs> you gotta give it the guts, right? Right, right. I love it. Yeah. Okay. See the difference that make? Very nice. Yeah. Okay, let's move on to Sarah now. Sarah. What kind of hair does Sarah have? Sarah has beautiful hair mm -hmm. that has a tendency to be a little bit staticky. Okay. So now we're talking about pomades that create shine. Right. And again, we have a little bit, this is going to be a much more creamy uh, uh, consistency. Yeah. And this is fabulous. At all times of year, but especially at the change of season when things are getting a little dry. We're coming out of, of winter right now. Everybody's got winter hair on the ends. Yep. You just start to work this through the ends and you'll get this beautiful, chunky, but undirty, uncontrived look to it, right? Got and it. all of a sudden, all her layers just start to piece out. Very nice. See the difference that that little tiny bit of product makes on the ends? And no more static. It almost calms it and tames it so you can have that rock and roll look, exactly, right? So exactly. the hair's gonna do what you want it exactly. to do. Very exactly. nice, okay. Good little pomade lesson there. 